getting our first look at the video of an attack on and off this metro bus. At first, detectives thought it was a hate crime targeting a transgender woman. Now they say the video shows something else. Cairo 7's Allison Grandy talked to investigators, and now she can walk us through this video. Allison? Monique, that victim told detectives she was taunted by those teens before she got on the bus. On the bus, she pepper sprayed them to protect herself. And then she got off the bus here in Tequila and they beat her up. But police went through that video. They say that's not what happened and the video proves it. Investigators say this video shows a transgender woman standing near the back door of a metro bus. Detectives say unprovoked, she walked to the back and pepper sprayed four teens. As they reacted, she walked away, stumbled, and fell. This one back here in the black, he's got the hatchet. You'll see him swing in a minute. Sergeant Ryan Abbott walked us through the video from December 10th. After one teen was pepper sprayed, he swung a small hatchet at the woman and missed. Right there. The woman got off the bus in Tequila. So did the teens. The next part was caught on a cell phone camera. Witnesses yelled for them to stop. You can see her lying on the ground, and they are punching her, and they're kicking her and stomping on her. The victim told detectives it all started earlier, before she boarded the bus at the Tequila International Bus Station. She claimed the teens used derogatory terms. We haven't been able to prove through video or witnesses that there was any other incident that occurred prior to this at all. That night, investigators arrested three teens, one 14-year-old and two 16-year-olds, for investigation of malicious harassment, a hate crime, and felony assault. Now, with the video evidence and interviews, they say that is not what happened. They didn't do it because of who she is or her sexuality. They did it just strictly because they were assaulted, and then they got off the bus and they assaulted her back. Now she is the one charged with felony assault. Oh. Now, right over there along this busy road, that is where the woman was attacked by the teens. Now, they're also likely going to be charged with misdemeanor assault. Now, investigators say they can't claim self-defense because of the time that went by from the incident on board the bus and then later when they got off here in Tequila. Live in Tequila, Allison Grandy, Cairo 7 News.